Welcome to Hashtag Be Beautify, where we learn what it takes to be you. Today, we are here to talk about some fun facts Fridays, which I just am so excited about. I've decided to come with a fun fact Friday because there's some things that I learned, and I'm like, are you kidding me? You gotta be shitting me, man. And yeah, this is hilarious. So, um, like I do, I read. I love to stay educated. And I'm reading through my old cosmetology. Not old. I'm going to say last year we had to renew our um, license. Um, and I'm reading. And it's talking about hair wigs and hair weave. And the interesting thing that it says, I'm going to read it to you guys word for word. Because I just, it's a short paragraph. So it says, Hair produced by horses and sheep, the latter called angora, is used more in hair pieces than in wigs. Hair pieces made of animal hair are often used for models in hair shows and hair competitions. We know that because, girl, you know we be working it on the model show, yes. Animal hair is soft, fine, usually has a glass-like finish. Hair produced by yak, a type of ox found in Asia, has become popular in the hair industry. How does an ox get popular in the hair industry? What did it do? Did it walk down the red carpet? <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, so it gets better. Yak hair is considered one of the best types among consumers. It gives the hair a somewhat coarse look and tends to be popular among African American consumers. This hair is natural looking when mixed with angora. Reminds you, it's horse and sheep hair. Mm. It gives wigs natural effects. Hair styles better with some angora. Mm. Okay. Most customers can obtain their hair for this hair for usage. And then I started like I had to reread. You know when something is like crazy when you like did I just read what I read? Yeah. So I'm gonna reread it for y'all too when I read it. Sentence. You may start find this a startling fact. All 100 per human, one, <laughs> oh gosh, all 100% human hair pieces, so labeled, must contain no less than 20% human hair. The remaining hair can be animal fiber. What? So you telling me that my hair could be 20% human and 80% some old animal, an angora. What is an angora? Oh my God. Listen, girls, you got to work on not wearing angora, okay? Whoo, I am so happy I had this fun fact Friday. Mm, 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 mm. It says the remaining 80% hair can be animal fibers. Mm. This animal hair responds to color just as human hair does. We've been bamboozled, guys. So we can heavily be bamboozled. That's why I shop Weaving Luxury. I'm just saying. I had to, you know, just, you know, get the plug. Get the plug. Because I know my hair is 100% human hair. Yeah, guys. Oh, yeah, I forgot to talk about my morning. This is how I slept last night in my braid. Mm-hmm. In my pretty PJs. They so silky. Well, that was Fun Fact Friday. And remember, guys, when you are buying 100% hair, it is a possibility that it contain 20% human, 80% yak. Don't get that yak. <laughs> you see them pictures of them yaks though? Oh, them is crazy. Cause I, listen, I be seeing some chicks with the yak. Like, oh my goodness, she got on the yak. So real, you know what I mean? It ain't yaki, it's yak, like a real, like the animal. I'ma start looking at weeds and call them an angoras. Like, what's up girl? Oh, you got that angora, huh? It sound good. <laughs> <laughs> that's so crazy all right guys i love fun fact fridays and i love being oh this feels great i love coming to you guys and seeing you guys make sure you subscribe to the channel and join the bu crew because we all cool calm collective beautiful people who love to encourage inspire and enhance the beautiful that already is in there you just gotta find it being you means knowing you. I'm still learning.
come on this journey with me. Thanks guys for watching. All right, bye-bye. Deuces, woo-woo. Awesome.